Hi, this is Noelle, and we're here at Oakwood Village Petites. And at this time of summer, everything's going real well in the garden, and maybe it's time to do um, a cool indoor project that you can grow outside in the summer and then also bring it inside for the winter. And we thought we'd start with just a simple terrarium. You can start with any type of glass container for your terrarium. And if you want it to be a drier environment, like a desert environment, you'd keep your terrarium open. So no lid on this one, and you would use any of the succulent type plants that you see in front of me. So I have some Echeveria here. I have some Sedum Ogon. I also have some small uh, cacti. And in that terrarium, you basically start, whoops, <laughs> we have tools here too. You basically start with your gravel or your hydrostone. And these items from Syndicate are really easy to use. They show you how to start your terrarium. Um, and you start with the hydrostone. And you basically just put this entire package down at the bottom of the terrarium to start out with. And this gives you drainage, but it also cuts down on any type of fungal growth that might grow inside here. The next thing is gonna be the soil. So you're gonna add your soil, your potting soil here. Um, and that's okay with the cacti. Again, it's going to be more of a desert terrarium. And I'm just gonna add about half the bag there. So we have a nice little layer of soil for the cactus. And then we're gonna add the plants. So make sure if you're using spiky cacti, make sure you have your gloves on. And we're going to add the cacti to the terrarium. I'm gonna to try to put the tallest in the back. And we can add soil a little bit later. Going to kind of just swirl them in. And then middle size, I'm going to put in the middle. So this cute Echeveria that's blooming right now. And that bloom is just starting to stick out. And then the sedum ogon, which is a, a really great uh, ground cover type sedum. We use it in a lot of different um, annual plantings and gardens, okay? Add a little bit more soil around the plant material. And this is kind of where some of your tools come into play because you might have to push the soil around to get it around the different plant material. Use your hands. And then if you'd like to add, you can add some dry moss or some sand if you'd like on top of that or any of the figurines from miniature gardening like a fairy. And I also have a few uh, sunflowers here too. And your terrarium's all set. So this is a real easy activity to do at this time of year, dog days of summer. Um, you can bring the terrarium inside and enjoy it or outside again, as I mentioned before. And if you'd like to try some of these make it, take it um, classes that we offer at Petiti Garden Center, um, do check out our website, www.petitigardencenter.com, and you'll see the seminar uh, box below. And just click on it, and you'll see all of our make it, take it's from there. Enjoy. Enjoy.